Hello, just a quick update about NetFTP and its ability to uh, use a trainer port, or in fact, will it work using a trainer port? It's not really an ability. As you see here, I've got my, my client and server hooked up. I've got my PS3 joystick, so that's doing its thing. Uh, what I've got coming out of the Arduino, uh, if you can see it amongst the mess of cables on my desk, is basically a, a little cable I made out of an old stereo lead going in the back of a 9X and I'll, I've set this up my car as a trainer so right now I put all the sticks we've got that and we've got the shuttle uh, we haven't got the FPV gear on at the moment that's been taken off temporarily for another project uh, but anyway the, the thing on this one was to just show that if I flick this throttle switch what I've done I've then taken the uh, the steering off of that and oops onto the FPV through the trainer whilst keeping throttle so I try and increase the throttle but nothing's happening because this is back on here which is if you're ever flying well, <laughs> when we fly it's going to be a when not an if we're just too obsessed with trying it now um, when we go flying, somebody else will be able to hold the throttle to stop the uh, the aircraft, whatever it is, crashing down. And of course, very easily take the flick off and controls back on. Yeah. Uh, and yeah, so anyway, what you need to do is, is basically take the ground and the uh, PPM over to uh, your stereo cable. One's on the tip, and the other one's on the the third one down. Is it the ring? Uh, so on a 9x, the tip is PPM, and the one nearest the other side is uh, is ground. There you go. Updates later.